As the Bible reminds us in Colossians, and over all these virtues put on love, which binds them together in perfect unity. Let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, since members of one body you were called to peace. And be thankful. Let the message of Christ dwell among you richly and teach and admonish one another with wisdom through psalms, hymns, and songs from the Spirit, singing to God with gratitude in your hearts. And whatever you do, whether in word or deed, do it all in the name of Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father Almighty through Him. In the time that Asher and Foster have spent together, they've built a sturdy foundation for a lifelong relationship through God. After a great deal of thoughtful consideration and prayer, they have decided to bind themselves to one another for the rest of their lives. May you all remember and cherish this sacred ceremony, for on this day, with love, we will forever bind Asher and Foster together. In Ecclesiastes, it says, two are better than one, because they have good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls down and has no one to help them. Also, if two were to lie down together, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alone? Though one may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. The cord of two strands is not quickly broken. Marriage is more than a simple exchanging of rings or combining of material assets. Rather, it is an indescribably powerful shared commitment. While today I will legally bind you two together, the truly important bonds we form today are largely invisible to the world, existing primarily in the unfulfilled corners of your heart. Marriage is one of life's greatest gifts, and it is a blessing to make these promises with your soulmate. As you hold on to one another, you will find deeper levels of joy, happiness, and peace together. Your marriage is the foundation upon which you will build the rest of your lives, and despite any adversity, will always be there to sustain you. The joy you will find as you pursue your shared lives will fuel you to face the head-on challenges you'll encounter on this earth. On your journeys together, keep your spouse in the space of highest priority in your heart. Learn to work together, to laugh together, to love together. Don't get caught up in worldly things that will draw you apart. Instead, focus on your shared devotion and turn inward. As your relationship strengthens, you will find that you come to share a remarkable love, a love that is both abundantly given and freely accepted.